All right, so Shelby's gonna come off of there. So I've got my leg bands that are filled up to 400. Shelby's gonna do some rows and some rollouts. She's gonna do what I just did. So I want her to do 15 rows to get her back warmed up, and she's gonna do 15 rollouts. So with the TRX rows, go start thumbs up first. See Shelby's already pulling high, and it's okay, but I want you to pull with your elbows. So you're really trying to squeeze your shoulder blades together back here, okay? So pull back and squeeze. Now while she's doing that, I got my leg bands on, I'm just gonna do some easy squats. Okay, so I'm gonna do about 20, just nice and smooth. Speed it up a little bit, get that depth going nice and smooth. So Shelby, after you do the rows, you're gonna do the rollout. Five, okay, I wasn't quite paying attention. <sighs> rollout. Okay, so the rollout, remember this is an anti ab extension, so it's kind of like you're doing that straight leg deadlift. So start where, see how high the bands are. So you're gonna go about knee level. So I want you to let the bands dangle about knee level. There you go, perfect. Over your shoulder, spread your feet about shoulder width apart. Okay. There you go, push your butt back. Let your knees bend just a little bit. And then as you let your hips come forward, let your body come into like a plank. So bend at the hips. There you go. Suck your stomach in, maybe shift your feet back a little bit. And then as you come out, there you go. Really hollow that stomach out, squeeze your butt, keep your stomach tight, keep your butt tight, keep your shoulders tight. Go to about 15. Now while she's doing that, I'm gonna do some push-ups. About 20, just nice and smooth. So I got my leg bands on and I'm pushing. I lost count. So I'm just gonna keep going until Shelby's done with the rollouts. And then she's gonna do two sets of each. So set it roll out and a set of the rows. Oh. I got three more. I'm a little slow at these. It's okay. Let's get hot in here. Got my sweater on. Okay, so she's rolling out. I'm doing push-ups and squats. She's got one more set of the rows, one more set of the rollouts, and I'm gonna do one more set. I'm gonna do a single leg squat this time. See if you can see my feet here. Switch. Okay, so she's doing the rows. I'm just gonna do an alternating. Get that out of the way. <laughs> So step back, high knee. Step back, high knee. Back, high knee. All chain, legs. Remember, this is more or less like a warm up. Okay, so back to the roll outs. Step back, lunge. Oh, I'll switch so you can see her. She's cuter than me. So, let's try better view. Okay, good. So that was a single leg step back lunge. She's doing the rollouts. Let's see how we're doing on that cycle. After that, we're gonna switch her to the legs. She's gonna do basically what I'm doing, and then we're gonna switch back and forth. So while she's doing that, two more. Two more. I'll stay up here like that. Okay. okay, good. What cycle are you on? Let's see. I'm on. Cycle number seven. Seven. Good, so I want you to do one more set of rows. One more. One more set of rows. Keep that back strong, nice and easy. While you're rowing, I'll do some pushing. How's those arms doing? Right in. Good. Doing good. Doing good. All right, good. So go ahead, hit the red button. She's going to go ahead, turn off the cycle. 
unstrap the arms. Okay, so we took the bands off Shelby's arms. She just did one upper body cycle on pro low. Now we're gonna throw the leg bands on and she's gonna do a pro high on her legs. So leg bands on Shelby. Okay, let's strap these leg bands on Shelby and let's get cracking. Here we go. So take that, that is the medium. Okay, so that's your left one. So you're gonna go ahead and throw it up underneath that leg there. Take a step back here so the crowd can see what's going on, y'all. Okay. Okay. So pull that up. Yep. Try to get this clip a little bit further out here. So loosen them up. There you go. Now pull this up tight. Take a little pressure off that leg. Pull and lock it down. There you go. Tight. That is tight. You want a nice tight base pressure on those legs. There you go. Strap that on righty. We'll go ahead. Take the tube here. Oop. That, just like that. So get that band way up in there, get it nice and tight. Taking that tube, connect that on there. All right, so what I want you to do, young lady, mm -hmm. you're gonna do squats and shoulder taps, okay? So she's got the leg bands on, she's gonna do just basic body weight squats, but then she's gonna superset that with a shoulder tap, kind of push up thing, try to keep that chest, shoulder, back, warm up thing going. So, fire it up, you're already on group. We're gonna do a group high. She did group low, not pro low. She did group low first, then she's gonna do group high for her legs. So, 20 squats, squat. 20 squats, just nice and easy. Watch yourself in the mirror if you want to. Nice and easy, 20 squats. Now I still got my leg bands on. So for me, what I'm gonna do, here, scoot it out of the way. I'm gonna go ahead and do some rows. So Shelby's gonna do 20 squats and 20 shoulder taps. I'm gonna do 10 heavy inverted rows, 10 overhead press, and 10 step ups. And then Shelby's gonna follow me along with that. So with the inverted row, we're gonna start with this TRX up nice and high about waist level. Remember, still got the bands on. Show take a step back for him, please. I'm gonna slide right on underneath here, keep my hips up in the air. I don't know if y'all can see me. There we go, just nice and smooth pull. Three, four, five, six, seven, nine, ten. Okay, so we've got a few dumbbells here, but we're gonna go ahead and do a single arm press. So we're gonna do a single arm kettlebell press. So take a 20 pound kettlebell, flip it, nice easy stance, press over. So I'm gonna do 10 on each side. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, down, swing it, don't hit your friend in the head, press it up. <laughs> This is good for your shoulders. Keep everything in nice, happy, tracking, good shoulder stability. So you're working shoulders, but not too heavy. I think that's 11. Okay. So I did a pull, did a press, these bands on my legs. I'm gonna do 10 jump squats. So nice and easy, jump squat. So throw your hips back. And up, two, three, four, five, six, Good, still got my mic. Good. Got it. All right. 10 jump squats, 10 rows of red press. So, how many is that? Is that two sets? Good. So, now for her, just gonna disconnect it. See where she's at. She was in cycle four. She's only about 300 SKU. So, that's good. So, now she's gonna go in training mode. And then I'm gonna put the armbands back on here in a minute. For now, we're gonna go ahead and turn that off. So we're gonna superset now the heavy inverted rows, dumbbell pullovers, and jump squats. Okay. So she don't know what that means. <laughs> That's okay. That's what I'm here for. All right. Inverted rows. So Shelby, you're gonna start. Grab these bands 
and you're going to walk underneath. You're going to keep your hips up in the air. Keep going all the way under, all the way under, just like that. And you're really going to pull your shoulder blades together. Up and squeeze. Keep your elbows closer to your body. There you go. Try to separate your chest. Separate the chest. You don't want to pull your arms down like that. You want to pull back. Pull the shoulder blades back and squeeze. 10, just 10. Nice and easy 10. So with that, we're going to do what's called a straight arm pullover. Okay. So a straight arm pullover. So that's a good way, right? So for me, we'll go a little heavier and I'll go ahead and do a demo set for Shelby. So I'm going to sit down on a bench and put these dumbbells here. So I'll set my microphone. All right, so get into a bridge position. You want your upper back on the bench. Take the dumbbells, put them up over your head. Keep your stomach tight. Let them sink back and pull over. So you want to keep your stomach tight. Two, going to 10. Keep your butt tight. Three, I think Cooper farted. Four. Five. You can even have your feet working out with you. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Okay, good. Uh, straight arm pullovers, okay? Those are great for your abs, for your back, for everything in between. So, Shelby, go ahead and put the dog down, grab some dumbbells. While Shelby does that, I'm gonna take my dumbbells and I'm just gonna do a double arm over and press. <laughs> 